Hello everyone, and I hope that you are doing well today, and that this video finds you in good spirits. Welcome back if you're a returning viewer, and welcome in if you're new. On today, I wanted to discuss a book by the name of The Gods and Goddesses of Olympus by an author simply known as Aleki. Now this is a beloved children's book of mine that serves as a pretty decent introduction to the pantheon of Greek gods, touching on the creation myths and relationships between their deities. I'm Leroy, and on this channel I discuss tarot, the occult, and saint work, so if any of that intrigues you, then consider subscribing and having a look around my channel. Now let's go ahead and get into the video. This is a hardcover book, although there is an edition that's available in paperback, and it was published in 1994, and it comes complete with that old book smell that many book readers love. So uh, this book, it's only 48 pages long, and it was written and illustrated by the same woman. So this is what the front of the book looks like. It has several gods and goddesses on the front, and the back of it looks like this. It says that it was $16, but it's actually much cheaper than that now. And uh, I'll get into that a little bit later. So, oh, and the book has a dust jacket, and this is what's below the dust jacket. Eros, or Cupid. Now, the inside of the book says this. Long, long ago in ancient Greece, people began telling wonderful stories or myths to explain the mysteries of life and death. These myths tell about brave heroes, fearful monsters, and gods and goddesses. The mightiest gods and goddesses lived in a golden palace high above the clouds on Mount Olympus. Zeus, the king of the gods, and his family reigned supreme over gods and mortals alike. Aleki brings these awesome characters back to life as only she can. Now you can meet the mighty Olympians and find out how they won their golden thrones. Read about their legends, their loves, and their fierce battles for universal power. So that's pretty much all you need to know about the book for the most part. I'm going to go ahead and begin flipping through the book. Now this book was basically my introduction into mythology in general. And ever since then, I couldn't stop reading mythology from all over the world, especially Greek mythology. So here we have... Uh, like a map of ancient Greece place where different things apparently took place all right let's go ahead and flip through the book now, I won't be reading the book it's not that kind of video but I want you to see just how the book is laid out and the kind of images and artwork that are featured within it Here we have the creation myths, how the world came to be. The birth of the Titans. And the Titans overthrowing their parents or their father. The father of the original Greek gods. And Zeus overthrowing his father, one of the Titans, in order to free his brothers and sisters. Oh, and by the way, if you hear any kind of like screaming or noises in the background, uh, those are some children playing outside, so don't mind them. Now here we have some of the different gods getting prepared for war with weapons made by the Cyclops in order to fight the rest of the Titans. Now, from this point on, most of the gods and goddesses, they get their own introduction pages like this, which I really, really like. Here we have Zeus.
So that's it. This is the Gods and Goddesses of Olympus book by Aliki. It makes me happy to share a piece of my childhood with all of you and to sort of give thanks to what first introduced me to Greek mythology. Again, this richly illustrated book is still available for purchase online if you'd fancy owning it. You know, it's pretty cheap to buy online. I just, I think I googled it right before I made this video. You can buy it for like $4, $5, $11. It's really inexpensive. I think I actually bought my copy for $4, which I was really happy for because some of the other some of the other books from my childhood are like really expensive because they're so out of print. For some reason, this one is still incredibly inexpensive. It's become cheaper. So, with that being said, if you enjoyed this flip through, then drop a like and subscribe for lots more upcoming content. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all in the next one. Take care.